In this video, we'll be talking about the ambiguous case of the law of sines, specifically when two triangles exist. We're asked to solve triangle ABC if angle B is 40 degrees, side B is 22, and side A is 30. Now we know we have an ambiguous case if we're given one angle and then two sides and the angle is opposite one of those sides. So we see that that's the case that we're going to be working with. So we're going to set up the law of sines. We have A is to the sine of A as B is to the sine of B. Now let's fill in our values. A is 30. And I don't know angle A, so I'll keep the variable. Side B is 22. And sine of angle B, which is 40. Now we'll do our cross multiplication. 22 times the sine of A is equal to 30 times the sine of 40. Divide both sides by 22. These will cancel. And we have sine of A is equal to make sure you're in degrees so open the numerator 30 times the sine of 40 close the argument on the sine function and close the numerator divided by 22 we have the sine of A is about 0.8765. Now this we know is in the range of our sine function. So we can do an inverse sine on that answer. Just sine. And then to bring up that ratio, we can hit the ANS key, which will bring up the previous answer. And we see that angle A is about 61 degrees, 61.2. we can uh, find our third angle. We know that angle B is 40, so we'll add 61.2 and 40, and we get 101.2, and then subtract 180 minus 101.2, and we have our third angle will be 78.8. So angle C is about 78.8. .8. So at this point, we'll find the supplement of angle A We take 180 minus 61.2 and we 118.8. So 
So now we need to check and see if we can have a second triangle. And we'll add those two up. from 180 and we get 21.2 so angle C could also be 21.2 so this is our second triangle. So here we have our first triangle information and here we have our second triangle information. Angle A could be 118.8 and angle C could be 21.2. Now we still need to find our third side. We were given A and B, so we need to find side C. And we'll use this ratio. 22 is to the sine of 40. As side C is to the sine of now for this triangle, angle C was 78.8, and then we can also set up the same thing. To find side C, but this one we want our angle C to be the 21.2. So let's solve these. We have C sine 40 equals 22 sine 78.8. Divide both sides by the sine of 40. These will cancel. And we have side C is 22 open my numerator, 22 times the sine of 78.8, close my argument and close my numerator, divided by the sine of 40. So side C is 33.6. And then let's work this one. We have C sine 40 equals 22 sine 21.2. Divide both sides by sine of 40. Let's cancel. And we have side C is equal to 22. Open my numerator. 22 times the sine of 21.2. Close the argument. Close the numerator. Divided by 40. And I have 12.4. So this is, on the left side, is the information for our first triangle. And on the right side is the information for our second triangle.